All right, Leo, welcome to Channel Sports on Sunday. I am Ken Ochonogo. Uh, uh, yes, we just have to smile, but sometimes when the news hits you, it hits you so badly that, you know, uh, uh, you are a bit dazed. And it wasn't as if uh, uh, it is not what we were expecting, or uh, maybe probably the news just came in out of the blues, because, of course, these this were, uh, uh, this were events that started unfolding right there, you know, uh, uh, at the, the Summer Olympics. Our own, the very best that we ever had, uh, for the for the past uh, uh, two decades or so, uh, because she, she has been uh, the the mono product that we have on good international competitions. Our hopes have all been pinned on the on the activities, on the achievements, on the outcome of the results of whatever Blessed Nokabari has been able to do right there on the track and even on the field. Uh, of course, we're all you know taken aback when you know uh, it was reported that she tested positive for drugs and was sent out of the camp of the Summer Olympics right there in, uh, uh, in Japan. So here we are, you know, uh, a few months later, and then the verdict is out. They said she has been banned for 10 years. Severe, you will say. But how, 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 how? How did they get there? She's a first-time off first offender. And then we expect that probably you give up, maybe, you know, formally it was used to be four, two years. They said, okay, four years, go for the first, you know, and then you come back. So. Uh, uh, we, we want to see if we can look at this. We are definitely going to look at it because that is where we are going to start, and we are also going to spend a lot of time, you know, on this this week, you know, this today right here on the show, uh, because the issue of drugs also is affecting this, you know, the the Winter Olympics right there in Beijing, uh, which is actually coincidentally ending today, where you know, Nukale Valeva, you know, 15 year old, has been the center. Of you know of it of, of it of it all an astounding uh, uh, gymnast one of the best that you can have uh, but then they said she three three substances were found in her system you know and as such if she actually she was actually first of all you know suspended from the games but then she went to cast and cast reinstated her you know giving citing certain reasons of you know probably because she's a minor and also the time that was you know uh, uh, from the time that she tested Pozamu, it was announced about six weeks or so. So they gave that as a caveat for her to come back. But the IOC also insisting that, yes, you have given your rulings. But for us, until it, the whole thing is cleared, any event where she is on the podium, there won't be a medal ceremony. And we, we saw what happened when she, when, when she came back and it affected her performance. 15 year old uh, being tainted with drugs. And then, uh, you know, Nigeria's very best, like we say, you know, being tainted with drugs. You know, how deep is this? Uh, you know, why do, why, why do athletes do it? And those, you know, how, how clean it is? I mean, you know, uh, is, is there any way that, you know, there are, let me say the samples can be tampered with. How transparent is, is WADA? How, you know, and where the samples are taken both in, in, during competition and out of competition test. So a, a lot of these things are, you know, we're probably what we, we, we are going to get, we're going to clear very, very, very soon when, you know, our, our in-house, yes, it's our in-house who's conscripted him in, you know, join us from Akure as usual, you know, to look at, you know, the uh, uh, Blessing Okabare saga. I, I must say this before, before, we, you know, we, we take that, and this is a personal opinion for me uh, uh we must this is the time blessing needs our support i remember you know she, she posted on twitter on you know uh i was that she has you know i mean she's been informed of what happened but uh, the reaction of most nigerians deriding the the, 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 the the abuse the verbal abuse is just not what i mean you, we, we do wrong but then when we do wrong she still asks we remember the good times and the bad times we don't just throw the baby and the better tie away that uh, that is what we are talking here uh, but before we go to that i'm saying that i've just chipped that in as my opinion as what from what are perceived in this this is not the time to hit the nail on you know to you to to to, to, to bury to, to to hit the final nail this is the time to show concern so say, yes you've done wrong if you if you have if she's found guilty yes she has your she should pay for it but i believe this is not the time for us to be to, you know for us to go there for us to be so abusive for us to be so, for so antagonistic, for us to be so, you know, you know, I mean, I, I, I do not know because I felt so bad reading what Nigerians are spewing on Blessing Akabari. She was a lady who has put, you know, so much smiles on our faces. So we we'll look at, we we'll, we'll talk, we we'll look at that the Blessing Akabari, uh, 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 the fallout of the Blessing, uh, blessing Akabari uh, issue. Um, I've talked about Kamala Valeva also. Uh, we'll talk about that. Uh, the Super Falcons of Nigeria, you saw them, you know, uh, at, at the beginning of this show. I uh, wanted they defeated uh, the Avarians by two goals to nothing right there at the M. Kabila National Stadium. And then at uh, the return leg, they've traveled now. I think they left this morning. Uh, uh, they'll be going to Cote d'Ivoire for this, you know, for the second leg for the Af Afghan qualifiers. Uh, that stadium, too, uh, CAF has said, uh, we can't be using it after now until 
March the 27th. I don't know. Uh, today is today is the 20th, 20th of uh, of February. I was talking about March the 27th. We're talking about you know, five weeks, five weeks of non-usage. I don't know uh, what state that the, the, the pitch is, but I believe that is just a little bit too far. Uh, probably they, they, they believe they, they, it is not uh, uh, the, the gra if it is grass, it has not been well laid or whatever. But for you to stay, for you wanted to, to follow, I mean, uh, so. At least Ninja Tomatoes are also playing their home matches there, if, you, know, you know, because they were banished right there. So a lot of things will come into play within this period as, you know, Kafa said we shouldn't use it. But we shall look at that and uh, look at the EPL. The EPL uh, is blown, both top and bottom, we are all blown open. City losing at home to Tottenham. It was a game they were about, they were, they, I mean, they, when, when you have to lose a match, you know you have to lose a match. It doesn't matter when you come back. Because when you come back, somebody will always go, you know, or, you know go forward again. And that was what transpired there. Um... In, 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 in Italy, uh, I, I mean, the, the league leaders also has to, you know, they, 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 it was 2-2 two -two against Salamitana. So you can imagine the bottom team, you know, with them struggling up there. It has not been easy. Uh, PSG were beating blue, black, and anything you can think of. By Nance, it wasn't just 1-0. It, no, it wasn't 2. It was 3. And it was probably in the second half before they pulled one back. So it, it was for, for, the, for the league leaders, you know, uh, in most of the top European, apart from even uh, Real Madrid, who even struggled against Alaves. I think, you know, uh, uh, in the first half, I think they, they couldn't find any goal. But they, they came out in the blaze before they scored those three. So we are, we are going to look at those things. But let me introduce my guys before we go to Akure. Uh, uh, Opa, you're welcome to the show. Thanks, Ken, for having me on the show. And good afternoon to our viewers. Uh, Theo? Uh, good afternoon, bro. It's good to be back again after a while. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so, so these are these guys are there. I want to see if we if we are ready. Uh, uh, probably uh, we shall we shall go we shall go straight. We shall see if we can uh, link up. Uh, if if we are ready, if not, we you know we will start taking the other. If we can go straight to uh, uh, Akure to see uh, to discuss with uh, 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 Akimbiri. But let us see if you can actually look at the letter that was lit by, uh, by Athletics uh, Integrity Unit. I think we can start with this. Let us start with this before we can link up with, with uh, Dr. Akimbiri. Uh, this was dated 18 February uh, uh, 2022, and it's from the Disciplinary uh, Tribunal Hans, Tribunal Hans Bless Nokabari, a 10-year ban for multiple breaches of the anti-doping rules. Uh, um, he said, the disciplinary tribunal has banned Nigerian sprinter Blessing Okabari for a total of 10 years, uh, five years for the presence and use of multiple prohibited substances, and five years for her refusal to cooperate with the uh, that is, uh, AIU's investigation into her case. You know, um, the sole arbitrator, uh, arbitrator abdicating the case uh, concluded that the at least use of multiple prohibited substances uh, substances as part of an organized doping regimen uh, uh, in the in, in the lead up to the uh, toyota uh, to the tokyo olympic games was an uh, egregious conduct, uh, conduct that amounted to aggravating circumstances under the rules thereby you know warranting an additional period of ineligibility in, uh, on top of this uh, standard four-year you know, uh, sanction, sanction yeah. which means she would have been sanctioned for so four for, yeah, years. Yeah. But because they said, you know, it, it is like it, systematic, it's a exactly. systematic doping. Yeah. Uh, because like the FBI have already investigating this, yes. and she was found to be part of that. You know, uh, to, to, according to their findings. All right. Uh, so, so that, that 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 is what they said. So we are, we're just, we're just taking this. Uh, for you, you, that is the letter from the uh, athlete, uh, at athletic integrity unit, and this is what they have yeah. just told you that it was okay. Uh, so the, the athlete has the right to appeal against the disciplinary tribunal's at the, uh, decision at the court of arbitration for you know for sport which is cast within thirty days. You know the uh, the, the reason decision can be assessed you know right here all right so she still has 30 days to you know uh, uh, to appeal but first of all uh, for, for to throw more light on this let us see if we can go straight to meet our man as always uh he is our own uh, uh doctor babatunde akimbinu uh, and is right there in akure uh, uh dr t are you ready hello ken <laughs> Hello, Lagos. Hello, too. How are you all doing? Um, it's a somber day to be here. Uh, this is not something to smile about. Yes, uh, but it is of course, not. it's a good day to be alive. It's a good day to be alive, and then when there's life, it's hope. So, good afternoon, Nigeria. And of course, I welcome all of you to Accra. All right. Good, 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 good afternoon, Dr. T. Uh, like we're saying, um, can you just give us a lowdown 
of what trans what what this is all about of course we knew we, it was announced we, we 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 discussed it when this thing came up uh, but right now the decision is out she has been bound uh, uh 10 years she they said it would have been four years but they said i mean they use the term egregious i don't know maybe you can explain that you know to those who are watching and they say probably yeah. that is because uh, instead of taking four years they took five and if that became five they not put another five for non-cooperation what do what what is what, 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 just tell us but what 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 was was she found guilty with was it uh uh, uh out of commission testing was it coming when when how we want to know exactly what transpired okay first <laughs> this is heavy heavy because I have some responsibilities with anti-doping relationship around the world too. Okay. So I'm only going to be giving an overview, you know, as it is. I mean, for instance, a number of friends know that I play some roles for CAF and of course all of that, you know. But that said, um, I'm just giving an overview from the outside. Um, probably just shed a little light on what is uh, what you've all discussed already. Now, um, the, the we all saw she, she apparently had an ooc that's out of competition test blood test now not urine sometime in stockholm somewhere in stockholm on this 19th of um july last year just before the olympics and then the results were released around the 30th just when she was suspended but the problem with doping testing is that once you are tested once your result comes out you, the anti-doping rules kick in absolutely if you found so that's exactly what played out with lesson calgary now, after that was found that she was suspended, um, a number of things have played out onto where we are. There's probably just one more stage to the end of it. That's that's um, her appeal to cast under thirty, under the thirty days, you know. Uh, but <clears throat> it is what it is. Um, the the egregious, of course, that just means severe. That means aggravated more than regular, you know. Usually, people get four years for doping offenses, but apparently what is in the news and what AIU has released is that blessing didn't cooperate with the with some of the investigations remember that these investigations are not the regular investigations there is this there's this uh, whistleblower scheme it's called the uh, it's called a, a russian name gregory rasdenko or something that's it's it's an american law that was passed by president donald trump former president donald trump that allows american government to investigate um, cases of international doping in national sports and all that. Now, that's what was used to um, try the person who actually made the um, chemicals, as it were, available to to um, Blessed Okagbari. Now, once that was done, this is a trivarium break, as it were. A number of organizations played a role in arriving where we are now. Um, the United States FBI, the United States Anti-Doping Organization, called USADA, you know, and of course, and of course, all of that has come to play a role in this, and of course, AUI and all that. And um, so, a blessing that you have read is suspended, not just because they found two banned substances, erythropoietin and human growth hormone, in her uh, blood sample, but also because she refused to cooperate. This refusal to cooperate is said to be that she refused to make her phone available, you know for for the investigations um, that's that is what the, the the aui's claim is and or but however when blessing was returning back to america because there's an american rule that allows for all of these investigations to take place so roshenko or something you know the fbi okay that's that's the news that's available were able to scan through her own device and so that's where the ends were tied up for and that's what makes up aui's case to say it's aggravated. It's not just a regular four years, which a number of other people have gotten, you know, in the past, but um, that she didn't cooperate and then you got to stamp it, you know. Uh, Russia is, is not yet competing in the Olympics as the country of Russia. It's the arrow city now, you know, because of these kind of issues. And um, it's unfortunate we just got the, the shorter end of the stick with possibly one of our most established athletes at the moment. Uh, 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 quite, quite unfortunate because, like you said, it is not something for us to smile about. Uh, uh, this is this, this has touched us where uh, uh, that cord which is touching is 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 so deep. Um, how 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 do I say it? How prevalent how prevalent is you know uh, uh, doping at you know in at at that level uh, for somebody as experienced as as blessing and then you know to get at almost at the twilight of, of her career to get involved in this uh, what 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 let, let, let me re, 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 retweet the question what do you think would have 
That is, if she, if she, you know, she, uh, if she goes there to appeal and they still find out guilty, what do you think would have led to something like this? Was this pressure? Was it, you know, uh, desperation, Des desperation, pressure, the will to remain at the top, the, 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 the fact that there's nothing else to do once you get out of the thing. Like, you know, sports and athletics is a very, very, it's a very dicey situation. Whether athletics or whatever it is. You get to the top of your career, you are at the very top of your career for a maximum of 15 years. You get global adulation and all that, you know. And once it ends, nobody's calling you the next day. It's like you were the president of a country yesterday, and tomorrow you're just not remembered. Nobody likes that. Your phone is not ringing, you are not training, you have to start a new regiment. Have you, have you seen um, the Brazilian Ronaldo? He's fatter, he's, it's difficult. You know, it's, it's so sometimes you just want to remain at that top. Uh, no, not everybody like Venus Williams, for instance, that her sister, younger sister is doing better and she's just doing fine, being 90-something in the, in the rankings or something. People want to stay at the top. And if you want to stay at the top, your body is not looking at it. Someone says, oh, I give you supplements. I give you multivitamins. You get better. Sometimes it's a, it's a very, it's a very, it's a slippery slope. You, and unfortunately, um, when they now say the thing is herbal, naturopathic, it's not a regular allopathic drug. You are not sure what is inside. It does not have FDA approval. We're not talking. Remember, all that, we're talking about the international standards. Now we're not even talking about Nigeria and all that, you know. So these, these are some of the factors that play. But of course, a number of athletes. So anti-doping is something we don't talk about in Nigeria. There is a very big field in the real world where at least most uh, the the world um, anti-doping organization, the International Olympic Committee, and all of that ensure very seriously that no athlete has an unfair advantage on another athlete in this true spirit of fair play and competition. That is, that is what the spirit of the Olympics is. That is what the spirit of competitive sports is. And you don't want to imagine how large the science of anti-doping is. You know, in Nigeria, we probably don't take it as serious as, as uh, it is really taken in the international space. And, um, well, I guess that's why some of these things play out. But then... Um, Maybe if we maybe if we took some of these things a lot more seriously. I mean, Blessing competed in Nigeria in Lagos to qualify yes. for the Olympics just just before one or two days. I mean, less than a month or thereabout before before the doping test that she took. That was for, I mean. So you want to ask how much of anti-doping activities do we carry out in Nigeria? We probably should not go there now. If we were so good, we would not be a class A country in the AUI list and got 10 of our athletes banned at the Olympics. And ask yourself, since we're banned, since our 10 athletes were banned at the Olympics, what has been the difference? What have we done? Oh, of course, the Athletics um, Federation of Nigeria announced my mentor, Professor Anugweji, as the head of the Anti-Doping Commission unit of, the, you know, of athletics in Nigeria. What have you heard in the news since then? Okay. okay. The ball is that, 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 is, that is where that is actually where I uh, you know I I I, I want I want I, I want to go to because uh, we've had some high-profile Nigerian at least you know uh, getting this and then also uh, the, the society in terms of drugs not just banned drugs but illicit drugs you know right around. You 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 you've, you've also worked in the sports terrain. You are still there, but I mean being involved with a particular club, running thing, and then saying things for yourself. How bad is this? And what, what, you know, what, what do you think we should be doing in order to combat it? Let's simply say that Nigeria doesn't care about doping control, more or less. I mean, that's not an absolute statement. But you asked me about my time with the top tier. I mean, I worked at top tier male and female football. We don't even do any doping control in football in Nigeria for starters. We don't. Our, our athletes experience doping tests for the first time when they travel abroad for international competitions in football. You know, so it's the Nigerian Anti-Doping Agency isn't exactly strong. There's a Nigerian Anti-Doping Committee, I believe. The doping structure, the anti-doping structure in Nigeria is very, very weak. Should we be doing better? Yes. Should we be fast-tracking what we should be doing? Yes. But then it just looks like we only complain when bad things happen. And then those of us, so I'm being careful as to what I, I even want to say right now, yes. because it's, it's probably not even the, you see, these things have to be done in offices. Administrative structures have to be put in place and carried out. We should not be reactionary to whatever. The laws are there. They are clear. They are not new. But, well, unfortunately, we just don't do what we should do. And then when there's, we then come and talk about what, what is bad and the, the, I mean, that's unfortunate.
Okay, uh, uh, before I wanted to go straight to Kamela Valieva, uh, you know, uh, uh, issue, but before I want to do that, I want to ask you, what is the relationship between WADA and national anti-doping you know, com you know, uh, uh, commissions of each country? Uh, uh, is, is WADA supposed to have offices or uh, what, uh, what is the relationship? <laughs> okay, WADA is the World Anti-Doping Agency. Yeah. Now that ensures drug-free sports and unfair advantage for everybody in the spirit of the IOC, competing, uh, competing at least. Countries are also supposed to have their own anti-doping organization, their own anti-doping systems, okay? That is, um, that has branches into anti-doping structures of each national federation, if you understand what I mean. So like, um, we got problems with athletics, for instance, and then the athletic federation of Nigeria, remember that they should have an anti-doping commission which will be under the Nigerian anti-doping agency in itself that should be affiliated to the world anti-doping agency. There are also anti-doping organizations in the international federations. There are anti-doping organizations in the national federations. You know, so it's a, it's a multi-septed part to ensure that there are no doping. WADA is not interested in, in your country. WADA is just like the parents, okay? The overall grandfather to ensure that there's no doping active there's no doping in the, in the world of sports you know working hand in hand with the ioc now in each federation like fifa there is a there's a medical and doping system half and all of that they've got that then the nigerian football association the federation if we're talking about football, the athletics football federation the nigerian ministry of youth and sports you have it you know an anti-doping unit you know and that should be under nigerian law so those are all things that you know so weightlifting wrestling hockey whatever there should be a robust anti-doping system. Now, Africa has maybe two WADA labs, maybe two, one in Johannesburg, one in um, Kenya. I'm not sure if the one in Kenya has been completely activated. You want to ask, why don't we have one in Nigeria? You want to even ask, who is the head of the anti-doping system in Nigeria? If you know it, you tell me, I know her, I know her. But how much does the rest of the world know? How much of anti-doping activities do we even carry out? So when we talk, look, I don't know, sorry. Okay, uh, 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 let's 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 keep it there. I, it's, I, I know I know it, it's it's touching you somewhere, but uh, let us keep it there. Let 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 us try and go to Afghanistan uh, 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 this time. Let's 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 go to Camila Camila uh, 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 Valeva. They said three drugs, three drugs were found, you know, uh, uh, in in her system. I don't know uh, uh, trimetazidine. I don't know what that is. Trimetazidine is one of them. Yeah. Uh, but that, that is a banned drug. Uh, there is also have yeah. a, a, you know, a, 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 a can, can, canitrine and canitine. then also canitine <laughs> and also hypro, hyprozen. Yeah. Hyprozen and canitine yeah. are not banned, but all, but, yeah. but, they, but, but all of them, they are all used for increasing performance by increasing endurance and reducing fatigue. So how come yeah. with all these uh, cars? says because of her age and what and her timing that you know they, they, they overturned the ioc ban on her well you have given the answer i will just break <laughs> it down a little more i mean you said it all now um trimetazidine also was found in our system that's usually a drug that is used to treat cardiac conditions like angina pectoris and all of that you know um it's been known to it's been in the rounds is it is it a drug for doping you know every year what are updates is anti-doping list and all of that so sometime around the year 2004 it's been classified as a, a drug that can affect um, that can create undue advantage and being placed on the doping in fact i think there was a chinese olympic champion by name was son young or something that uh, was the first casualty of this drug you know, in the year 2004. But there's an, uh, another American, um, I'm mixing a name up right now, maybe in 2008, that um, that drug, the, the, the major drug that's on the doping list now, not the other two, you know. There are things, for instance, for I'll give you an example. Caffeine, you know, it's not, it's not on the doping list. It's a stimulant, all right? But it's not on the water anti-doping list. But morphine, okay, it's on the water anti-doping list, you know. So, uh, so it depends. The way the anti-doping list is something revised from year to year and all that, okay. you know. But but so the primary drug now for which she's been found is is the is the trimetazidine. And now for reasons that you have mentioned, one, she's a minor. Under wider rules, the way you treat a minor, anybody under eighteen, is different from the way you treat somebody who's an adult. Even when you are taking their sample, whether urine or blood, the way and manner you go about the testing. You know, and obtaining sample is a little different from somebody who is not a minor. That's one. Then 
the sample for for all right, um, uh, 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 this Dr. T, Dr. T, just hold it there. We are going on a very short break. When we call by, you break down out, and then you know uh, we run it up from there. Stay with us. It is a channel spot on Sunday, and then you go. You have nowhere to go than to stay with us. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, welcome back. Uh, we've, you know, we've, we've, been, we've been having this discussion with uh, uh, Dr. Vatende Akimbinu uh, on this uh, Lesno Kabari and Carmela Valeva issue on, on drugs. Uh, 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 Tunde, are you, are, you, are, you, are you still there? So that, you know, uh, of course, sorry we interrupted you. We just had to go on that short break. Uh, uh, you were saying no, that, you know, yeah, that minors are treated differently, you know, you know, when it comes to this. Can you just retake that and then also the second part of it? Oh, okay, so there are three reasons. One, she's a minor. Yeah. Number two, minors are treated differently. Minor, anybody under the age of 18, by what their rules, is quite different. You know? Then number three, every anti-doping test result must the, the decision, the finding, especially if, if, if positive, must be conveyed to the athlete under 30 days. With Blessing or Kagbari, for instance, it was conveyed to her under 11 days. However, because of now, in, in um, Kamilva's situation, I think that's yes. the name, you know, Valia, yes, she, Kamil, she, had, yeah. Kamil, she yes. had a test done on the 25th of December by the Russian Anti-Doping Agency. That's a country that was said to be involved in state-sponsored doping. During the trials for the Beijing Winter Olympics, she came first and she was tested. Remember that um, Camilla is a 15-year world champion in um, figure skating. Yeah. She's really been junior champion, world champion, European champion. She's that successful. They took her sample on the 25th of December. Normally, in 30 days, you should get your result. For whatever reason, Lali associated to be, usually, is expected to be due to the COVID issues and backlogs, you know, and all of the issues associated with COVID and all that. That is, people work less and all the breaks, things are longer with the way COVID has changed, the thing, way things are done in the world, Camilla got her test result after the games involving her are taking place, had been completed, the team sports at the Olympics. Sophie to say that she had already won gold in team figure skating with Team Russia before the results were released. Now, it meant that immediately she, immediately the results were released, the, the, the medal ceremony was supposed to be on February 8th in China. It was um, initially suspended because immediately the results got out. The Russian anti-doping agency, and I like it when I mention U.S. anti-doping agency, Russian anti-doping So you understand why I'm a little... Yeah, of course. That you know, just, you understand Nigeria, why I'm a little we, Tomorrow we're talking about Nigeria yeah. anti-doping agency. E yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so that's why I was a little, you know, immediately suspended her. Now, immediately, the Russian and doping agency subspecies, there is a Russian Independent Disciplinary Anti-Doping Commission or committee that resigned that suspension. Look at oh, the country that initial, that the athlete is from, that the athlete has what, initial, decide, ask me what we have done to our okay, but, but before we go here, okay, decided that the athlete be suspended. Now, the next day, Another independent at the doping board in that same organized that same country says that, that that suspension can be lifted immediately. The International Olympic Committee, the International Skating Union, and the International and WADA all appeal to CAS to agitate that these athletes should be suspended because uh, she's, there's a doping sample that it should be found doping. You know, a banned drug has been found in a, in a urine sample. Okay. Now, CAS listened to that appeal almost immediately and decided that the athlete be allowed to compete because of these three extenuating circumstances that, um, or these this, uh, this different three circumstances that, that we have all mentioned earlier on. Now, while, and then, of course, the IOC and WADA have decided to broaden the investigation because she's a minor beyond her to her team doctors and her coaches. Because, of course, she's under the age of 18. I also then decide that the medal ceremony where she's won gold will be suspended indefinitely until this investigation is concluded. So that's the situation with um, Camilla right now. 
It's a gold medal in an name team ceremony, but uh, there are investigations. In, of course, Camilla has gone on to say that uh, this is a drug that uh, was contaminated. This, this, this drug contaminated her supplements or whatever she's using for With her grandfather's drugs, drugs and all that. Yes, uh -huh. there are, There's also the school of thought, you know, that uh, you can, well, anybody can say anything. There's also the school of thought to say that does this drug exactly, does it, does it, um, does it give enhance. you advantage? Okay. Does it enhance, um, you know, oxygen uh, delivery to the muscles and reduce fatigue, especially in a sport like skating, which is not something that demands a lot of um, fast um, use of muscles or something, you know. But um, I, I, I think that the, what they are an anti-doping agent is try to err on the part of caution. So if there's a possibility, uh, they simply inform the rest of the world very early. The anti-doping, um, the the anti-doping, the banned drugs, the anti-doping list is updated every year, and all everybody involved in sports has access to it. So they make you aware of it. They tell you what your obligations are. Every athlete is responsible for whatever is found in his or her system, you know, and all of that. So uh, let's see how this investigation pan out. You you know how elaborately your Kagbari investigation panned out, for instance. Yes. You know, um, for. I mean, one of the reasons why Akakbari has aggravated the situation, you know, is because, like I mentioned earlier, she didn't make her phone available, you know, to AUI initially. But again, by the time of returning to America, um, apparently the FBI got pulled and they used the American laws to X-ray her phones and all that. You know, so let's see how all of this play out. It's unfortunate that a 15-year-old is caught in the middle of all of this, but, well, you can't do anything but to ensure. Nothing is better than um, ensuring... Um, you know, drug-free sports and um, all over the world. No, nothing is better than that. If we see sports as business and entertainment, then it should be in the most, in the cleanest possible way. And uh, that that justifies all that goes into it, all the entertainment that we get, and of course, all the finances that uh, goes into it. Too. I think that is where we want to end this. Uh, 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 you've thrown more light. In fact, I, if they, it, it, it is going through your, your, your submissions there, that is when I, I, I thought, actually thought it was the Camilla people that went to CAS. I never knew it was you know, the, the WADA and all that went to CAS before CAS took that decision. Uh, uh, Dr. Akimbinu, it's, it's been a pleasure speaking with you. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure always. All right. Yeah. Gentlemen, uh, <laughs> <laughs> what what book are we at there? Uh, uh, b b b blessing did come, you know, when when uh, when um, these decisions were made, yes. uh, blessing came she, out with she, this, she, she, you know, uh, on Twitter. Yes, sir, my attention has been drawn to the statement <laughs> issued by the AIU yeah. regarding the disciplinary panel decision. My lawyers are currently studying it for our next line of action, which we will inform you soon. Okay, uh, I said, you know, uh, uh, her lawyers are studying the decision of the IOU regarding uh, the disciplinary panel decision, and then she, they will inform us soon, uh, as soon as they meet. Uh, but they, this case doesn't look too good for her. 43, 43 page, when the decision comes in, 43 pages, yeah. you know, uh, of, of, of investigation. Yeah. I, read, I read that summary, and it's like... An, an, an extensive... Uh, 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 the cardinal uh, upon which law rest is a uh, fair year again. Yes. So, but... <clears throat> The worst thing that could happen to anybody is trying to frustrate that principle of that doctrine of fear here. Yeah. Now, these uh, the here you are alarmed at a non cooperation. They, they said the standard uh, penalty ban is four yes. years. Four years. But because one, non hearing is uh, uh, non cooperation is five years. Now, the standard is four years. The additional one year because it's not your usual yeah, system. It's even more ad, not ordinary doping, but advanced no, level system, systemic Ken, doping. I, 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 I will say this: uh, though it's not trying to exonerate whatever has happened, we put Nigeria as we put blessing. As you said, she has been our best athlete over the past fifteen yes. years. Yes. We put pressure on her, but that is not enough to justify. And as the doctor said, athletes want to stay at the it's top. Now, can, let me uh, bring this. Apart from this advanced level, at home here, yeah, you know, he said, uh, Dr. Akimini said about it, I've been at the National Stadium several times, and you see professional athletes actually patronizing all these multi-level marketers. Yes, it's good for swear. I said, look, have you checked the list? I'm always alarmed when I get to National Stadium with this athlete. Yeah. We are professional athletes. You say, oh, it's good for... No, if I take it, you can't take it. Go and check the list. Is this thing bad or not? So, why are we moving away from blessing? Let's even focus on people here at home who are professional athletes, but 
but still behaving as if they are laymen. Are they not so? It's, it's, so if some, now you, you observed it. Yes. Are those persons that are taking care of them? Yeah. They, we have federations yes. under which they train. We have people that are supposed to say, okay, fine, Minister of Sports. But, yeah. We have, you know, he's talking about, we have anti doping agents. agents in Nigeria, not, yeah. not individuals that will go okay, to okay. who say, you give them lectures, you, 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 you enlighten okay. them, you, uh, you, you do all that. If you, you, you tell them, if they are telling them consistently, okay. from the first day they come to come, they give them orientation. If you are going to do common NYSC, you, when you enter, they say orientation yes, camp. camp. They want yes. to, they want to put you through. If a company, if a company uh, em, 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 employs you, you know, they, they, they give you a guy like they, 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 yes. they give you training you or whatever. Yeah. And, and the, 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 these basics, the absence of the, do we, do we even know? So by the time, time you communicate yeah. to them, you make them understand that okay. You, you 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 are going to definitely get tested, you know. And at the end of the day, you get tested, you are found positive. Then you don't you won't get to compete. But like you said, it, it, it's, a, it's a systemic thing. It's it's literally just from the top down to the bottom, and you know, back up there. But I feel really sorry for her. She's been at the top of the sport for so long, and Ken, I just don't know. It doesn't look really really what, what, right for what, her. Yeah, what what do you think? <laughs> what, what should we as at now? To yes. me, I, I, I've voiced my own opinion. Yeah. I, like I said, this is when Nigeria. She needs, needs, she needs her support. She needs this our support. This is when Nigeria needs, you know, she, Nigeria, you know, sometimes you need. We, we, we've been on her. Yeah. She, she has given her all to Nigeria. Yes. This is her lowest. No matter what, what I, 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 I give an example. There is no. There is no. Sportsman that has done what Maradona, you know, uh, you know, Maradona went the to the into yeah. drugs, into sh into shooting, into that. But that, that adulation of a nation, you understand, was still there. Say, this is this, these are his flaws. This is if if she's found guilty, this is her flaw. But is uh, is it right for us at this point that to condemn her to and her to, to throw her out? Or to, we're not trying to pat her on at, at the back. But say this is when she needs yeah. whatever moral support she have to go through because this is a trying time. She if, has made a Ken, mistake. If you if yes. you commit the crime, you serve the you time. Serve, exactly. Of course, definitely. The time, yes. yeah. Having said that, now blessing is someone we have said in the past since uh, we left, she has been our star mm -hmm. for the past 15 years, both track and field. Yes, and the thing is, this we will always need our experience going forward. Always. So that's why we can't afford to throw away blessing. And if, 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 she's, she's, if she's banned, they will ban her. She, she, she won't even, they won't even allow her to, you know, to no, 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 to, 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 years, be, involved, to be involved at all. Ten, in ten, ten, once, once an appeal is made, yeah, mm -hmm. it will be. Of course, because you are okay. not cooperating, it, yeah. it could be reduced to because it was to take okay, exactly, exactly. failure to cooperate yes, in the first yes, instance. Yes, yes, yes. 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 uh, ben Johnson, I think Maurice Green, they got lesser sentences yes. yes. because about they about cooperated. Yeah. cooperated. So, what will happen is this we we'll still need her. So, that's why we cannot afford to throw away the baby. And what the is this lady's water. name? Mario Jones. Mario Jones. Mario, 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 yeah. Mario Jones. So, so yeah. right now she goes, she goes ben, down ben to, the, Johnson, to the schools and you know. Ben right, Johnson's yeah. case in Nate because I watched the trial like five years ago. They, it was made clear to him that once he cooperates with the investigating partner, he will get a lesser sentence. Yeah, sentence. That was done. So we we'll still need blessing. Um, yes, you serve your time, but again, uh, it's not now. We now every time they can now start throwing the stones. So All right. Let uh, the, we say correctional center. So someone is not in the correctional center, you are still flogging. So once the time is served, we'll still need that. All right. I, I think uh, they, they say we can now take calls from you guys. You can you can join the, con the discussion, join the show. Uh, uh, let us let us hear from you. Uh, <laughs> uh, it, it is not the it is not the very best of times for us because she's been our star, she's been our daughter, she's been what we look up to. But then uh, uh, from what we are hearing, it is not a very good news for her and for us too. Uh, uh, what, how do we handle this matter? How do we make sure that you know uh, uh, the next blessings will not fall into, into the same trap or you know go the same way of this particular blessing? But of, of all, what in your own opinion, what should Nigeria do? Dr. Akimino said we don't even have the, you know uh, anti-doping control agents in this country. It is there, but it is sleeping. We are not active. You've just had a person. He goes to the national stadium, and our athletes we patronizing. You know, uh, 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 like all those drugs are in Molwe. Uh, they, they have drugs that solve everything. Bobo <laughs> You know, you, if you take this, you go ahead, take it to stop that. If you drop that, ah, this. Is, have you taken this? It is good for me. Have you taken that? Oh, it, oh Agbara, all oh, Agbara, and stuff like that. So I mean, how good are these? And what are you know? Uh, the, the substances that are contained in this are they banned substances? We've just had that. Camilla uh, 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 Valeva, that there is, you know, a, a, a tramadazine uh, that is there. That, that one is, is banned. But there are also two, the hyprosine and then canetine, that are not banned. Well, so this, I, don't, I don't even know what they are. I'm just, I'm just hearing of this is for the very first time. Our athletes, how enlightened are, you know, are they on all this? The lines are open. You talk, uh, uh, Rem, Remo Stars, they started very well like a house on fire, but they've lost two matches in a, in a, in a row. I don't know, but the league is on. And that is how we are saying. Manchester City and uh, Liverpool is saying we are on your trail. You know, uh, a, a, lot, a lot of this happened yesterday. So, um,
Let's see. Let's, let's take some of those. Uh, uh, why, why we are waiting for you guys to join the discussion? Let's take some of those results that happened. Before we come to the local league, uh, uh, let's see what's happened at, uh, at in, in Europe during the week in England. Uh, some of the results that happened, like we said, Manchester, uh, uh, let, let, me, let me start with you. <laughs> Manchester City, they're playing a Tottenham that has lost three, three on, in, in three, three, three in, in a row. row. Yeah. And then, uh, okay, uh, we already have if a... Fine, a if I is calling from worry. If fine, how are you? Hello, if fine. Yeah, how are you doing? Fine, how are you? Well, I'm good, I'm looking good. I'm calling from Wari, I'm a lawyer. Okay, I'm oh, beautiful. I'm not listening to Blessing of uh, predicaments. Yeah. And I'm telling you that um, that is a conspiracy from the international bodies. Okay. reason being that um, this is an attempt to weaken Nigerian strength in terms of freedom track events. You know for sure that uh, when it comes to freedom track events, Nigeria, of course, is living life in Africa near the world. And that is to say, sir, with all due respect, blessing has been the right, and they have always looked for every means to see how they can stop blessing. And that's exactly what is happening. I strongly believe that if that test is reconducted again, that certainly a different result must actually be achieved. In effect, I'm saying that the international body, the moment they see an African athlete, if a black athlete for that matter, especially from Nigeria, being so well, this conspiracy will come on board. On how do we dampen the zeal of the person to achieve high? Only if she has achieved high, how do we make sure that she doesn't go further so that whatever she, have achieved, she may have achieved in the time past of the rubbish? Take your mind back to the time of uh, Mary Onyale, Chidimo, and a host of others. At the point they said Imo was on drugs, at the point they said Onyale was on drugs. See, these things are what we call racial conspiracy against African athletes, especially when they are black. And I'm saying that. That result is a word. That is bogus. That is hallucination. That is even psycho the delusion of grandeur on the side of those of them who carried out that result and came out with that sick uh, result and everything. I will stop there, Ken. Continue doing the right thing. Up channel television, up channel sports, channel channel go. For great things. Adieu, sir. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much, if I, <laughs> uh, if I say it's a conspiracy. But, you know, uh, but, but because, uh, as, as a lawyer, like, like I said, uh, the, the, there is something they said, they, they asked, uh, do you know, uh, you know, uh, uh, Eric, Eric Lira, yeah. and he said, she said, you know, you know, she doesn't know, mm -hmm. she doesn't know him. But when they got, when they were able to, you know, uh, uh, for uh, investigation, get, no, they were able to get hold of her phone. Yeah. There was a message from her after she ran here in Lagos. After, I think, uh, after she ran that, uh, uh, is it in Jebo? Which uh, the other tech, when she ran that seven point something, uh, yeah. nine point something, mm -hmm. nine point six three, and then she, there was a message she sent to uh, Alira and said, look, I don't know what you did. But it work. It is working mm. wonders. Can, can, I mean, I think uh, maybe uh, <laughs> with due respect to uh, by Stefan, um, we have a Diavurian Talu yeah. who has even won Olympic medals um, on on the track. Yeah. Bless her, only got got uh, uh, gave us medal from the field. Long jump world yeah. championship mm -hmm. or with other medals from world championship and. Uh, Commonwealth. So uh, the issue of uh, conspiracy, I think we should play. Uh, turn it down. Turn, uh, okay, let's take a whole affair. Hello. Hello, this is whole affair. Hello, are you? Oh, how are you? Oh, fine. Thank you very much. Oh, uh, what I'm just seeing is that. Uh, uh, the issue of this uh, this lady, I think. Uh, the, the time they are doing the investigation, you know, this, I mean, cooperate with them. I think that's why he's going far like 10. How ah, can you give him? How ah, can you give him uh, 10 years? I think it's because it's, I'm sorry, it's because it's a black. That's what I'm just seeing here. Okay. All right. And then how far uh, buy my book now? He doesn't call me for my book. <laughs> Oh, 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 can you? Oh, I will call you after this show. I told I, I called you that time, and then you told me, uh, what, what is I it? Talo, ta, 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 ta sorrow. I, I'm driving. That was what you said. I'll call you. Definitely, I'll call you. So okay, I'll tell you where to much. pick up, where to pick it up. We are Kuala United System today. So, yes. please, I told you to interview Bashir Jimo. Jimo Bashir, that is our media officer. You don't, don't interview only. Uh, I, will, I, will, I will interview your coach. It's better I interview your coach so that we can Thank hear some Thank you very family. much. No, uh, are you not? You are talking now. Yeah. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Okay, uh, <laughs> let, let, uh, it's good to also enlighten and educate um, uh, uh, people. Exactly. Yes. Um, every time in history, 
once you cooperate with parties. So we don't waste their time. We don't waste their finances. It is their resources. Uh, their resources. resources you don't put. So because once you cooperate, you get a le linear sentence. I, she's I, a first offender. I tell you, blessing will have gotten away with like 18 months, 24 months. Because she's a first Ken, offender. Ken, United States and the Doping Agency. The FBI and the U.S. Attorney's Office uh, yes. came together, investigated. So you don't, you don't waste your time, and they presented the facts to you, and you are not being forthcoming. These are facts. We have money. I mean, I mean, this is in, in so all these things. people see to hear you, anybody. And you can make mistakes. It's so acceptable. God, cooperate and, and let it be. Because I mean, I, I know I, ten years is extensive, and anybody that hears it without proper information, that, just that, 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 is, that is premature retirement. Yeah. That, that is what it is for a for, 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 an, for an athlete that's been at the top for so, so, for so long. You'll give her ten, 10 years. That is, that is thirty-five. So yeah. where would she? Not everybody should know now that I can still be playing at <laughs> the same, you know, but I think I, we should I, all I, get that message, <laughs> that lesson. She didn't come. She didn't come. Let's cooperate with. Let's go to another short break. When we come back, Channel Sport on Sunday continues. Stay with us. Okay, you welcome back. It's the Channel Spot on Sunday. Uh, we're still talking blessing or cabaret. It is sometimes we just have to wear that smile because this is, like I said, this uh, really touched us from the from the first day the shock, you know, uh, when it was announced that you know uh, this is what she did or she what is what she you know allegedly did. Uh, but right now, uh, it, it has gotten beyond that. The uh, I, I, the uh, uh, what that team came in and all of them and said, This is what we are saying. The, uh, the Atlas Integrity Unit said, We we'll find you guilty. And then uh, instead of taking a minimum of uh, a maximum of four years, which like, like my guests are saying in the house, uh, probably if she had cooperated, probably they would give her 18 months or two years. And so, okay, fine. Uh, it is your, your first time offender. We've not found anything on you. Yeah, but like I said, it is not something that probably you took uh, uh, unknowingly. And then because the person they are, investi they are investigating someone. And it was that person was linked to her. That is where that is that I think that, that that is the bottom of this. That that is just part of that. Look, the guy we are of the, we, 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 this guy, we, you know, uh, has been they've been on his tail and said, you no, know, he has been supplying, he's been supplying drugs to at least. And that's why you know there is a new law was made that if you are fine supplying drugs, that you you are into it. So where the FBI is already involved, it means that is what touch that yeah. touches American national uh, 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 almost like as if the national security yeah. that you are touching about today. I remember Americans have to go and you know uh, uh, go to another country, Panama, Panama, kidnap their pre yeah. carry their president to America to come and answer because of drugs. They don't take anything yeah. uh, drugs lightly, even whether you are taking it for yourself uh, or you are giving uh, it to uh, others. And also uh, the, the because it's sports related, yeah. uh, the main founder of uh, financier of um, um, Nacional in yeah. Colombia, uh, Pablo de Escobar. Yeah. Yes. You know, he had to use everything he had to fight against the extradition law in Colombia because they said they wanted him. In fact, he had to go to the as, um, National Assembly as a member. So uh, is they don't joke with it. They do not. Okay, let's take those results in England. Let us see what happened. The lines are still open. You, can still, you are still joining us. Uh, so let's see. Uh, yesterday, what happened? You're talking about uh, uh, before we went on break. Manchester, Chelsea, City. Uh, Manchester City taking on. Okay, they say, they say the, the, the the best way to lose, <laughs> or the best way to win, is equally the worst way to lose. lose. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, it was not just Manchester City's day uh, yesterday, and there you see the result, the result on your screen. Man City losing at home to Tottenham Hotspur by right? uh, two goals to three. Arsenal defeating Brentford by two goals to one. Aston Villa shocking their defeat uh, against Watford. Yeah, that, that goal, that goal was Emmanuel scored by Emmanuel Dennis. Dennis. I'm a yes. sweet, sweet, sweet Emmanuel goal. Dennis. I think, and, then, and then I think he's coming back to the Super Eagles. Hopefully. Yes, he's coming back. back he's Eagles. coming back. And then uh, out of nowhere, uh, Burnley, like they're... Uh, I'm right, telling you, the bottom the, teams from, from, from the dead, and uh, defeating Brighton at Hobart Albion at home by three goals to nil, and uh, Crystal Palace. At the death. Yes. And then the same man that the, his, his nation doesn't want. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, ZH. ZH, ZH, yeah. Yes. And then Liverpool coming from behind to the field. Which I, I, love, I love this Liverpool girl because uh, Mane scored equalizer. Yeah. And then Salah scored his 150th goal. Yes. You know, yes. Man, Mane's goal was. was, 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 was Scissor, Scissor, you know, Zagalo. Zagalo. Ex ex exquisite. <laughs> and Southampton defeating Everton by two goals to nil. And uh, West Ham in a one-all draw against With, Newcastle. Uh, Newcastle now, the, uh, uh, where is smiling? Five yeah, matches on yes, beating. Yes. yes. No, you know, he, yeah. he said it. They're, they're not yes. going on the drop. I mean, I, they're, they're, as, as long as Newcastle doesn't... They, they if they survive, don't go on the drop, by they, next year, they should be fighting for the title. Yeah, yeah. It, 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 it took take five years. The new Man City. That the new Man City. This is what you can. Money can do a lot of things for you. I tell you. 
But you look, you, look, you, look, you look at the Manchester City game yesterday. Yeah. You say to yourself that on a good day, there's nobody that can stop Harry Kane when he decides to come to the party. Yeah. Uh, you talked about the fact that a couple of their goals have been contentious, but uh, well, that's why we have the VAR, because one of their goals is actually ruled out correctly for upside. But for every time Manchester City seemed to get back into the game, Tottenham had a response yeah, for them. And then you now look at the fact that it's a Tottenham team that has not won their last three matches that have done the double. Not just won, they lost their last three matches. They lost their last three matches. Three matches. Yes, they, they've, now, they've done the seemingly impossible. Yeah. Like shocking Manchester City at, uh, at, 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 at home. At Etihad. You know, at the Etihad. So uh, uh, it's a good one for, for Antonio Conte. Hopefully, probably this uh, win might breathe some life into his Tottenham side and he can go on to challenge for a European sports uh, this season. But... Okay. Uh, uh, at the, at the, at let go at La Liga because okay, Real Madrid Liga. are 18 points ahead of Barcelona as it stands. You uh, are very specific with Real Madrid and Barcelona. <laughs> 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 you need to forget that we have Sevilla, Betis, and quite a number of them. Real <laughs> <laughs> Madrid, Madrid is the best. The Madrid struggled actually, but got back to their groove in the second half. Three goes to nil. Cardiff spent a one-all draw uh, okay. against Hetafe. Yeah. Osasuna losing at home to Let's Go Madrid. They needed this one. They've been losing games back and forth. Uh, they won this one by three goes to nil. Luis Suarez scoring a fantastic goal yesterday, and of course the yellow submarines visiting Granada and stomping them by four goals. To All one. right. So as as, as as the Real Madrid are up there, I think Barcelona will be playing today. Yeah, Barcelona yes. will be playing. We playing. Uh, I think uh, Valencia. Will, will, yeah, they will playing visiting Valencia yeah. uh, today after their game midweek against. Uh, 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 Napoli, where they play the one or draw. But hopefully, Barca winning today sends them back into into so, the, into uh, the top can four. I see the big boys. Uh, not the big boys, not just the boy. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so Barcelona is not. The yeah, Barcelona is six. Six. Yeah, yeah, six. Six. I think they are six. Yeah. They are, so that, that that, that, that's why I said they are eighteen go, points. They go back conference. They are eighteen points. They are. They are. They are no, but, but, uh, but they have but, a match. They have a match or two. Yeah, they have like two games. All right. The Solomon is calling from River State. Okay. Hello, hello, Solomon. Hello. Solomon, uh, how are you? I'm cool, and you? We are fine, we're fine here. How is Port Harcourt? Uh, very fine today. Okay. Yeah, well, well done, guys. Uh, I want to, you know, comment about uh, Blessing, our sister. Yeah. So, it's, uh, you know, it's a very sad day all over Nigeria because of uh, the image didn't paint all good at all. But I want to also, you know, advise uh, the athlete kids, those that is in sports, yeah. to, to tell them that the one billion mistake can not make an effort right. So no matter how we tend it, the truth is that uh, let's try to, it, 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 let's be satisfied for what we have. Let's you not know, because of maybe we want to show the world that we, want, we are the best at the end of the day, it will tarnish our image you know, as a country, or uh, all of us. Yes, this a particular art is not our culture, and it can never be our culture. Okay. So, sorry for, the, sorry for the inconvenience. I want to take her to take her, maybe, uh, more, if she has time in future, she can still, you know, train our younger ones that like, coming out, exactly. you know, what next to do. But yeah. and I want to also urge the NFF and the people that say, let's not, just not for you know abandon her it's time for you know to come to her and uh, you know embrace us embrace us as a daughter exactly. please thank you thank you very much that's exactly what we are saying uh at the minister of sports uh at the uh, at uh, uh, afn at least federation of nigeria you know you reach out and have you reached out to her ask her what is happening how is she this is the time forget whatever rules whatever laws that are up there uh, and this is when to comfort her. This is when to talk to her. This is when to tell her to calm down. This is when to make her also see reason. Because probably if they have reached out to her, oh, yeah. you know, and you know, and counseled her, uh, she, will, she, she will not follow this antagonistic uh, approach. Uh, 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 approach. Yeah. She has said, okay, these are my deeds, these are this, and then and whatever it is, and it, things would have been okay. Oh, yeah. It doesn't really matter because they will still, no matter how you deny, if you have done it, they will still get to the root cause of yeah. it. No, technology they, now takes it. Because they've already linked her with. You know, already, already after her performance in, in Nigeria for the pre, pre, pre Olympic trial and stuff like that. But if we have reached, if we have not left her on her own, we we'll talk to her like father talking to their children, you know, to their to their daughter. I say, my daughter, calm down. It has happened. What do we do? How do we go about this? But you leave her on her own to talk to her lawyers. She's when she's competing, she's competing for Nigeria. When she was at her best, she was her best yes, for Nigeria. Nigeria. Yes. So now that she is down, we should come. We should Nigerians all over the world should come and you know and, and talk to her. Hello, Abubakar. How are you? Abubakar, how are you? Hello. 
Talk to us. I want to know what is happening at Zamfara. Hello? Ah, okay. If we can't get her, if we can't get him, I don't know what I see more. Is that Abubakar now? He's still there, yes. Hello, Abubakar. I think I can hear him. Oh, he's cut off. All right. Okay, Abubakar, you can call back. What's going on from Zamfara? I'd love, love to know. <laughs> That's Gusu. Wow. Probably from Gusu somewhere. You know? So, okay, let's, let's, uh, um, that we, we've, we've taken the, uh, 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 the, let's look at uh, Italy because it wasn't too good for, uh, AC Milan. That's why I wanted to see a swimmer. No, no, man, they, everybody, they, they survived. Yeah. Were two, two goals no, down. Like, oh, my God, back, Verona. Verona. Back, back to back yeah. draw for but, Roma. But, 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 no, no, he's, see, he's, he's we, sad, we know that, he's he's you know, he, he was special. He's he was, sad. he was the special one. <laughs> uh, but now, he is the struggling but one. He started, <laughs> he started the season on fire. Okay, but, let's, 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 let's go back to uh, Quara. Bobby. Yeah. Who's that? Bobby. Hello. Hello, Bobby. How are you? Fine. I'm good. I'm yeah. Good. We are fine. We are fine. Uh, are, you calling, are you calling from Milori? I'm calling from Milori. You're supposed to know, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Go on. So, what you say is, uh, you know, it's, very, it's, very, it's, it's, it's a pity that uh, this thing happens to blessing of God, uh, or Kabare. Kabare, yeah. But, however, the... Uh, the, the, the federation should not uh, let her alone so that we should try to see uh, to, to support her. So that it, it should also serve as a lesson to other sports uh, athletes, exactly. especially the footballers. They are always on drugs. So we need to uh, give them a sort of education so that this one will not happen in the nearest future. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, 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 what, what he just said, because you know, from what we also gathered, you understand, most of those who are handling our footballers, they, so they say, go and take, uh, uh, I don't want to mention the drug, go and take this, go and take it that, does. and then it will, give, uh, yeah, it will boost, just like what you witnessed yeah, firsthand yeah. at the National Stadium. It's what we are talking about here. Are uh, you handling a footballer's team, and then the medical doctor tell them, don't take this. Say, oh, what do you know? Uh, go, go and take that. Go and drink a <laughs> Go and take all yeah, yeah, and and uh, one, one thing with drugs, drugs you, yeah. one thing with drugs, uh, you can't go out of the system. Is it? Let me give you this short instance. I've started a year before. Uh, Udvola, Udvola, yes. yeah. the German team to the World Cup in 2002. He was not supposed to be the coach. I can't remember, recall the name now. Now, he was doing so well for Leverkusen. The, now, the national team, the, uh, the German football federation, the DFP, now contracted him to take over the national team. Mm -hmm. So, Udvola being the general manager of Leverkusen, went there to negotiate that, okay, give us like six months. They said, okay, if you can't come, we we'll develop take over the team. Now, at the sixth month was coming, uh, maturing, there was this uh, uh, breaking news that the guy was a former drug addict, cocaine user, and personalized prostitute. He denied everything. Later, they tested his hair and found out that actually, his, over this period of time, he was taking cocaine. His hair. His hair. Yes. Let's go to Aquai Bomb. Hello, Sunday. How are you? <laughs> Hello? Sunday, how are you? I'm fine. Yeah. Let's go. Uh, let me join the rest of Nigeria to say it's pity that what happened to Blessings. To Blessings. Please. Please should sound as a caution to the rest of Nigerians. If their body is no longer carried for you to go ahead, instead of put the country name into a mud, voluntarily by a segregate us. Without doing one or two things that will bring the dirty name into your family. Because what actually happened at the woman affected Nigeria. The Nigerian name is in the world map at the woman as one of the drug countries in the first. Yeah, we're in the earliest. Yes. Secondly, secondly, I yeah. want to say congratulations to the people for what they did yesterday because the spirit, they fight back after there was one go down. I enjoy that kind of spirit. I wish all the team would have that kind of speed. When you won't go down, you've been able to come back again. And these two players showed the classes very well yesterday. I enjoyed the football. I mean it. I never enjoyed football at that time, at that yesterday. Okay. This is the third thing I want to talk about the Super Eagle because that is my best thing. I want to beg the NFL. I want to beg the coach. We should do everything that we can within our power to make sure that we qualify to the World Cup because. The Nigeria will not find it funny if he failed to qualify to the World Cup. Cup. I'm going to beg whoever is in charge at the moment to do everything right to make sure that we be in the World Cup. All Thank right. You.
Thank you, Sonny. Uh, as, as we speak, uh, Coach Guavoy, uh, and, uh, uh, Emmanuel Amunike, they, you know, I mean, they watched all the matches. They, 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 were, they were in UK. Yeah. Uh, uh, they, they are meeting with the players. They are watching the matches live. They are doing their updates and stuff. So we, I think we, we, are, we, are, we are right there. Uh, we, we've just said... Uh, 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 Lukman, FIFA has just said Lukman can yeah, join yeah. the team. Yeah. We Manuel Dennis scored yesterday. Yes, yeah. uh, so uh, the, the boys are now, they are, they are picking up the team is coming together. And that is uh, what I think. Uh, and MPFL matches will take place. So yesterday, the prayer warriors, yes, their prayers were answered. They went to Abba and played George Finigis uh, at Eimba and got, a, in, in fact, uh, they got a 1-1 one -one draw. Eimba scored first in the seventh minute and then uh, in the, by, the, by the 12th minute, bam, the player, the uh, 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 prayer warriors, MFM, they collide, and that is the, that was the final score. The yeah. No goals after <laughs> after after, 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 after 12 minutes of the first half. That's it, and that, that is how it ended. So they picked up a valuable point. They are still at the bottom of the of the of, of, of the uh, of, at least of, of the league. They win and it show. But at least uh, they are so now, today uh, is a derby local derby. Um, uh, Kwa United uh, against uh, Dakada. Yeah. Uh, Gumbi United, Anna uh, United derby uh, against Plateau United. Uh, who show shooting stars how to play the game in the course of the week. Now, Kano Pillars takes on uh, Abia Warriors. Castina United, um, Aflan, Lobby Stars, uh, Stars Derby against Remo Stars. Um, Nashua United takes on uh, Niger Tornadoes. Uh, Rivers United against Enugu Rangers. That is, that is hot. Shooting Absolutely. Stars um, against Austin Wicked Tourist. Uh, Sunshine Stars takes on Quara United. So that is, that is it. Uh, Aquara United, we, you know, we, 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 a, a whole affair. I hope you are watching. Uh, go and watch your, your, your team. We'll take a look at the sunshine, visit the sunshine stars. stars. And then the Akure lads are not, they are not, they are not smiling. So let us see what is going to happen there. Uh, I, I think that Rivers Rangers, you know, uh, should be the star, star match, match. For, you know, for, 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 for the week. And like you said, uh, MFM is, you know, they are, they are gradually picking up. Yeah, picking. You know, win they win and a win, a win so. and draw four points within a week. And probably if they continue that way, they will climb, they will climb up there. So that is, those are, those are the, um, those are the things, those are the things that works. So, uh, Ken, on this, uh, FIFA letter. Yeah. Uh, calf let, calf yeah, the, letter, not the calf, the calf, the calf um, letter. I, you know, <laughs> <laughs> you have teams play their uh, league matches on Saturday. Yeah. Play European or continental competitions on Tuesday. On Wednesday. On Wednesday. Yeah. Tuesday. On the same. Now, this uh, have come we just finished. Garua Stadium was hosting a match every other day. Every yeah, other back day. to back so to back. So yes. what, now, what <laughs> the ten day or how many days? I don't, that, I, 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 the, I, I, the, the letter was not written in good faith. So <laughs> <laughs> was not. He said the letter was not even given. We're trying to so, ask uh, because the Dagode group spent one one million dollars to put that yeah, okay to put that place in order. Guy, we are we are we are we are rounding up. All right. Uh, concerning blessing the cock very well. I, I wish I wish her well, but whatever the case may be, uh, I, do, I I believe that well many Nigerians have her at heart. I will keep praying for her. But most importantly, people need to understand that whenever these tests are carried out, it's for the good of the sport to preserve the integrity of said sport. So yeah, yeah we stand solidly behind blessing the cock very. Yeah, her still on blessing. Uh, we are not condoning what she has done, uh, but again, it's time to cancel her and let us say uh, the reason why this is happening. Yes, uh, it is time to cancel her. It's time to draw home. They say you don't throw away the baby and the bait water. She must have transgressed. She must have done what is wrong, violated the rules, according to what we are hearing. Uh, but this is the time for us to stand behind her. It's time to say, yes, our daughter, you've, done, you've not done very well if, you're, if you are found guilty, but please, this is the time to say, take it easy. We are your parents and we will be with you. I'm Ken Ochenogo. Have a good day.